वेलकम बैक टू जॉन्स म्यूजिक इन केस यू आर ऑलवेज कन्फ्यूज अबाउट विच गिटार साइज इज राइट फॉर यू दिस वीडियो इज फॉर यू दिस वीडियो इज ऑल्सो फॉर गिटार ट्यूटर्स सो दैट दे कैन रिकमेंड द राइट गिटार साइज फॉर द स्टूडेंट्स ऑफन अलॉट ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स एंड अप बाइंग द रॉन्ग गिटार साइज एंड मेकिंग दैम वेरी अनकम्फर्टेबल टू प्ले इन द लॉन्ग रन सो विदाउट एनी फर्दर डिले लेट्स गेट राइड इन टू इट So in today's video we are exploring five different guitar sizes so that you can make a right choice of size for you. The first what we have here is the dreadnought size. One of the most popular sizes that is selling in India. The popular models can be Yamaha F280, Yamaha F310. What we have here is the Cort AD810. This is one of the biggest sizes available among all the guitar sizes. Now what we saw before was the dreadnought without a cutaway. This what we have here is a dreadnought size with a cutaway. So a lot of people call this an F cut guitar but unfortunately that is not the right term the right term of this is a guitar with a cut away the F cut guitar is when you have literally see an F written over here which is found in many semi hollow body guitars so right now what we have here is a Cort MR 500E which is a dreadnought size with a cut away so the next size that we have here is the grand auditorium shape or as popularly known as the concert size The length wise the dreadnought size and the concert shape is almost similar just half an inch of difference but the major difference is between the bouts this area is called the lower bout and this is the upper bout of the guitar so comparing to the dreadnought size guitar the concert size guitar has a difference in size that is a smaller size in the lower bout and the upper bout it also is more curvier making it a more comfortable guitar this particular model what we have here is the Kepma EAC There are other popular models like the Yamaha FS80C, Yamaha FS100C, etc. So the next size what we have here is the orchestra model, or in short form, it's called the OM shape. This is one of the least common models among all the other guitars. So this guitar has a bigger bout than your concert size guitar, just a half inch more, and it generally does not come in a cutaway. However, one of the popular guitars is now launched in cutaway, the Cort Core OC series, which is an orchestra model. The OC stands for Orchestra Cutaway. So generally, the orchestra models are more popular without the cutaway. And this model, what we have here, is the Tanglewood TWBB O. O stands for the orchestra model. The next, what we have here, is the travel size guitar. This is usually a 36-inch size guitar, and there is a variation of this which is called a parlor size guitars. These guitars have been recently popular especially with Ed Sheeran using the parlor size guitar. It's a very compact size guitar and has a good quality sound that even professionals like. The bout size is smaller than all the guitars compared before this and it's a very compact guitar to hold for all age groups. This model what we have here is Kepma ES36. The other popular models are Fender FA15, Gresh G9500 and hence forth. So the final size what we have here is called the junior guitar size. This size is only aimed at kids below 8 years of age. Most junior size guitar also has smaller frets so that the kids can easily play on this guitar. Lengthwise this guitar is ideally 34 inches but can be 34 and a half or 35 as well. The bout size is very small and that is why this is particularly useful for kids. Uh, we would not recommend this size of guitar for any kids above 8 years of age. This guitar what we have here is the Crusader 34 size guitar. The other popular model that we usually recommend is the Pluto HW34. Now coming back how to choose the right guitar size for you. This is one of the primary things that you should consider while choosing the guitar. A lot of students have seen struggling with a big size guitar. Now this for example is a dreadnought size guitar. So now when I'm putting my hands over this, it's very important that the hand has a lower inclination or at least a little parallel level. Any person whose hand may go up like this is not the right way to play the guitar. It will cause pain and injury in your shoulder and it is not great for longer hours of playing. For example, here is a student from our academy. You can check that this Cort AD810, the dreadnought size guitar is very uncomfortable for him. You can see the inclination on his hand going upward. with this kind of body size he is unable to play this with any comfort and he is even trying to peek into the fretboard how to play the guitar we have given the next size that's a concert size guitar this is looking much more comfortable for him he is able to access the fret much more easily the hand has come a little more parallel to the ground and this looks more comfortable but if you see the next size that is the Kepma ES36 the travel size guitar 
the student looks much more comfortable with the guitar with easy access to the fret and the hand being comfortable over the guitar. So the right size of the guitar is very important for the student to learn comfortably and play the guitar in the long run. A good amount of practice is what makes the student improve on the guitar and that can be severely hindered if the right size is not chosen for the student. So now the dreadnought size guitar is very comfortable for me to play. My height is 5 foot 10 inches. So any person above 5 and a half foot, the inclination on the hand will be very nicely down and hence it will be a relaxed position on your shoulder and not giving much strain anywhere. So any person who's below 5 and a half, I would generally not recommend the dreadnought size guitars for reasons of comfort. Now this is a concert shaped guitar, much more fitting into the body and that's why I can access the fret a little more. Also the OM shape is a good shape to consider if you are not looking for a dreadnought size guitar. The concert and OM shape will be a very comfortable guitar. Now a very important point is what are we missing out when we are moving to different sizes. The dreadnought size guitar is a big size guitar and will give the deepest bass and the loudest sound. The concert size and the OM shape will give lesser bass, however, it will be enough for any student who is beginning with. In terms of intermediate players and even professionals, they already know what is the kind of sound they are looking for. So the shape is not exactly what they look for more, the sound is what they are exactly searching. So in terms of being a beginner, instead of hunting for the loudest bass or the loudest sound, it is very important and the most crucial part to select a guitar that is more comfortable for you. Now what we are recently loving a lot is the travel size guitar. It's a very compact size guitars and many age groups can play it comfortably. So starting from the age group of 10, this is even suitable for adults because the fret size is the standard size and the guitar is something that you can hold very comfortably. The travel size guitar is also great for female guitar players because it's a very compact size guitar for them to carry around and even play. If you are a person who frequently travels along with the guitar, this is one of the sizes you should definitely consider to buy. So one thing to mention is because this is smaller in size than the other guitars, this will be lower in your bass and even in your volume. So to conclude, choose the right guitar size for you based on the comfort. If you have a friend's guitar, you can try that out and know whether this guitar is right for you. One thing to know very well is that there is no size that is perfect for all. Each person will have their own preference of a guitar size and each size of a guitar will have its own sound that it can offer. So there is no right or wrong thing here. It totally depends on the person who's playing the guitar. I hope this video helped in choosing the right size of guitar for you. If you are a guitar tutor, I hope this helped that you can educate your students very well in choosing the right size. The link to buy all these guitars shown in the video are right in the description. You can click that for price and more details. So thank you for watching. Subscribe to our channel for more product reviews and educational content. Until next week, see you.